Hi, I'm Jeff Raymond, Vice President of WIT Lining Systems. In this video, I'm going to show you how to properly measure a tank for a drop in liner. To make a tank liner, we need the inside dimensions of the length, width, and depth of the tank. Measure at different points, both top and bottom, and measure the depth in each corner, because your tank may not be square. If the fillet weld is greater than a half inch, we will need to build that into the liner. For the tank flange, measure from the inside of the tank to the outside of the flange. Also, measure the thickness so that we can provide the proper width clip. Be sure to measure all four sides as they may vary. For an outlet, we need the inside diameter of the pipe, the length of the pipe from the inside of the tank to the outside of the flange face. If the outlet needs to be fabricated into the liner, we will also need the center lines. A boot is similar to an outlet, but it sticks into the tank. What we need is the outside diameter of the pipe and its length. If the boot is to be fabricated into the liner, we will also need the center line locations. We can accommodate an angled boot, but we'll need more information, and it's best to call the factory. To make this process easier, we have a fillable form on our website. If you need further assistance, please contact us or visit our website. Once again, I'm Jeff Raymond for Witlining Systems. Thanks for watching.